I think the, the dream over the years for a lot of game developers is that we can actually release a game and engage multiple audiences. When, when Microsoft announced that they're going to actually support cross-play across all their devices, we've heard this before, <laughs> and so it was little, I was a little bit skeptical. But then once we got our hands on, on Windows and, and the APIs and started to fool around with it, it was amazing to see that like it really does work. We work with custom technology, it's our own engine, and uh, all the APIs and all the plugins, everything, it's pretty seamless. I was sold on Windows 10 the moment we realized that you can actually copy text from anywhere in Windows and paste it into a command prompt. That, that's, a, that's a miracle in and of itself. From going to Xbox One to Windows 10, uh, it's been amazing that I can just almost just switch the compiler to compile for Windows 10 and it works. It, it's a lot nicer than having to rewrite a majority of low-level code. Crossplay for Blowfish Years and or Seachcraft Commander is huge because it's actually a game that plays really well across mouse and keyboard, uh, gamepad and even touchscreen. So what this does is allow us to give the game to everybody and for them to play you know, multiplayer with each other. We've always wanted to allow players to buy a piece of content and play it wherever they are whether it's on their phone, their Xbox One, or their PC. A normal porting process, you would expect like uh, two weeks to four weeks just to get it up and going. And I mean, just to say, hey, we had it up and running day one, and you know, 24 hours later we had it on the store, that's pretty shocking. Now we're thinking of it more uh, like holistically. We're taking the PC player and the console player and thinking about them together. Microsoft is the only company that's in that position to be able to do that because nobody else has a desktop kind of gaming platform and a gaming console platform. It's really, it's a great time right now. It's exciting, it feels like something new is happening. So we're just grateful to be a part of it. Unifying all these experiences is going to be really important in the gaming space. And the fact that they're recognizing that and bringing that to back to PC is uh, really important for developers like us. If you're developing for console or you plan to develop for Xbox One, I, I can't think of any reason why you wouldn't want to develop for Windows 10 as well.